Greetings from Team Rex team. Today I'll show you how to use a Blogger shortcode. It helps to display your blog posts on any part of your website. Let's add it to our page with Elementor Page Builder and learn how to customize it towards our needs. First, let's add a section and then in the left side panel type in the shortcode's name Blogger. Drag and drop it into our section. Ok, good, it shows three latest posts. Let's customize them. First, let's pick the layout. There are multiple pre-made layouts for this shortcode. For example, news, classic style, portfolio, when the title pops up when we hover the post. Standard and classic are the most commonly used, so let's work with them. You can display certain posts by simply typing in their names into the field posts to show. For instance, best gold watches. And let's pick one more. Every time I look at my watch. Below you can change the count quantity of posts to display. For example, if we remove the articles by names and increase the count, we will see much more of them displayed on our screen. Next, we can arrange them into two columns so they look nice. In the Layout section, you can manage hover effect, metadata and overall design of the shortcode. For the beginning, let's reduce the number of metadata and keep just the essential information. Ok, now it looks better. We can return to our Content tab and order our posts by date descending. And if we switch back to a layout step, we can rename our read more button. Now let's increase the number of displayed posts and change pagination to page numbers. At the bottom of the short code, we will have a numeric pagination. Now I'll change it to an infinite scroll and click Preview Page. It's a rather popular feature. When you scroll down, new articles are automatically loaded. Let's return to our customization page and rearrange posts in three columns. In the Layout tab, we can enable a slider mode. And if we click Preview again, we will have our posts in the nice slider. Let's turn off this mode and check options for our hover effects. For example, you can disable all hover effects or show an icon. Choose a zoom effect, slide, excerpt, etc. You can also display your posts on the page by categories. Let's display just accessories, for example, and then add a movement category. It also shows you how many articles you have in the particular categories. Hope this video was helpful and don't forget to subscribe.